Take a seat. Hello there. My powers have doubled since then. We would be honored if you would join us. Hey guys, welcome to a new series that I want to cover. This one's basically going to take all the information from canon comics and Legends comics, basically in the description at the very end of each comic. It'll cover every character from either the comic writer or people like Dave Filoni. So today's will be about Asajj Ventress, and it's from the new canon comic, Age of the Republic. Let's get started. Asajj Ventress. Although originally conceived as an unused concept for Palpatine's apprentice in Attack of the Clones, Asajj Ventress eventually appeared in other media including 2008's The Clone Wars TV show. A native of Dathomir, homeworld of the magic-wielding witches known as the Night Sisters, and the birthplace of the Sith Lord Darth Maul, Ventress was trained in the ways of the Force by the Jedi Knight Kai Narek. But when Narek was killed, Ventress' rage put her on a direct path to the dark side and to the Sith Lord Count Dooku, who took her on as an apprentice. Armed with twin red blade lightsabers, Ventress was a formidable combatant and had numerous encounters with Jedi Knights, Obi-Wan Kenobi, and Anakin Skywalker. But Dooku eventually betrayed her and left her for dead, under orders from his master, Darth Sidious, secretly Chancellor Palpatine, who perceived Ventress as a threat to him and his dark rule. With few options left to her, Ventress eventually became a bounty hunter, over time, it became apparent that goodness, compassion, and a sense of honor had not been extinguished from her fully. We thought of all the characters developed for the Clone Wars, Ventress had become one of the most interesting. The show's supervising director, Dave Filoni, told a crowd at San Diego Comic-Con in 2014. Indeed, she became the subject of a 2015 novel, Dark Disciple, which wrapped up her story in dramatic fashion. The book was based on unproduced scripts that the show's creative team had written with George Lucas. We had these great ideas for Asajj Ventress. Filoni said, expressing his happiness about those ideas coming to fruition. So I really like how they continued her story in the Age of Republic canon comic. She now has become a bounty hunter with a really strong moral code, helping this little girl, as we can see. And I can cover this whole comic for you guys if you so wish, but I figured this video would be very concise and fun. The comic is pretty cool. It basically covers her seeing a bounty for Ahsoka Tano, filling in the gap until Season 6 of The Clone Wars. Well, thanks guys for joining me for today's very brief data file video. I hope you enjoyed it. This is a new series that I wouldn't mind making. Uh, it's tons of information, and it's very concise and time efficient. If you enjoyed this, hit like, and I'll continue the series. Until the next episode, remember, the Force will be with you. Always.